What's going on guys, South Florida African Cichlid Zamor here, bringing you an awesome little video. So this, as some of you might know, we went to Imperial Tropicals last week and we got to handpick some fish. And this is going to be pretty much an unboxing video and introducing them in the tank and seeing what they look like. Uh, right now you're seeing the OB that we got. It looks like an OB Red Empress. He's very platinum white. He's got blue, red, and he's got orange egg spots. A uh, cool little thing is we actually met the owner of Imperial Tropicals, Mike, while we were up there. We weren't expecting that. And he's the one that gave us the tour and showed us like some of the fish we were looking for. And he cut us a great deal at the end. Uh, right now you're seeing the Venustus. You saw the Borlei before. Venustus looking great. That's a 5 to 6 inch fish. So here you can see how I take them out. This is how I acclimate all of my fish. I just give them about 15 minutes to settle in to the tank temperature after floating them. And then I put them like so. I held them in my hand just so you could see them. Very nice guy. Five to six inches. It's really hard to find one like this down here. I've been struggling to find a male in Miami for a while now. Just put him in the tank. Let's see how he does. Hmm. Straight to the bottom, he's a little stressed out. Gotta give him a little bit of time. So this next fish that we're opening up here is the Redfin Borlei. I believe there's a regular Redfin Borlei, not a Kadango, so it's not like the super red ones. But uh, either way, a very nice specimen. He's starting to get the white on the tips, blue face, and he gets an orange body. So let's let the fish settle in for a while and let's see uh, what they look like. Catch you guys in a bit. So this is my first unboxing and I forgot to show the OB as I put him in the tank. But here you can see some pictures of the fish. This is the OB. He's looking great. Uh, the Borley eye. You can see the orange. You can see the white coming in on his fins. He's a really nice dude. And last but not least, the Venustus, which will probably be our tank boss later. <laughs> now let's take a look at a video of them in the tank adjusting. So the fish have had approximately 24 hours to settle in now. And let's take a look at them. So first up, let's see who we can find here. There's our big boy Venustus. You can see him right there. He likes to pretty much stay in the deeper part of the aquarium and he'll just like hold down a spot. You can see his, uh, his blaze is starting to come in. I think he's gonna do great in here. He's uh, about five, five and a half inches. He's not the biggest guy in here, but he's definitely one of the biggest. Love how this guy looks. He's got uh, some nice X patterns on both sides. Definitely top-notch guy, really lucky to get this guy at this size. And we got him for a very good price as well. Just starting to come this way a little bit. Check that out. And we got our OB that we picked up. It's kind of hard to see him there, but he's stunning. He's uh, pretty much like a platinum white with a blue and red. And he's got a little bit of orange on the fins. See him better here. He's really, really nice. And the other pickup that we got is this red fin Borley eye over here. It's kind of hard to see him. He he's not really colored up at all. He was a lot more colored up, but uh, he's kind of like yellow orange right now. Hopefully, he'll turn more red. I don't I don't doubt it, you know, it's a good good supplier. So all these fish, these three fish are from Imperial Tropicals. They gave us a great price too since we were from out of town and we drove up there. And another fish we actually picked up today, we traded uh three of our females and we got two female yellow labs and we picked up this male peacock. Let's see if we can see where he's at. Yeah, so he's gonna be back here. He looks to me like, kind of like a red flush or a blue regal kind of. The guy told us that he's a he's a blue orchid, but I've never seen the blue orchid with like a red shoulder. Oh, 
this is just one of our little fries, but he's a little bigger, not much bigger. Let's see if we can catch him. He's on the back side by the sponge filter. He's right there, it's extremely hard to see him. See if it'll come up. So yeah, we have a lot less females in this tank now. It's uh, We're gonna have like four females in here. When all said and done, hopefully that'll reduce aggression a little bit. Oh, here this guy is. Look how awesome he is. Damn, he's hiding again. My light doesn't really capture him down there. There he is back there, guys. It's really nice. It's about three inches. He's got full color. Just about. Alright guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed already, subscribe for more fish content. And hit that follow button so you get updates whenever I post a video. Catch you guys later.